Hey lovers, it's your girl Disastrous Beauty coming back with the voiceover. So the unit I will be reviewing today was sent to me by Diva Wigs. Shout out to you Diva Wigs for sending me this unit. Okay, the cap construction on this unit, it does come with three combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps. And this is a 5x5 five five lace closure wig. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and style this wig y'all and I'm going to let you guys get into it. And if you are interested in any more details, specs and all that good stuff about this unit, then please continue to watch and I will see you lovers in the outro. Honestly, finished styling this wig and this is what I got. If you are interested in the details, the specs, and all that good stuff about this unit, then please continue. Okay, so this unit was sent to me by Diva Wigs. Shout out to you Diva Wigs for sending me this unit. I really do appreciate it. So the unit I am rocking is... Uh, 
It is their new gray 16 to 24 inches super fine HD invisible undetectable seamless Swiss lace 5x5 lace closure frontal human hair with wand curls. Whew, honey, that was a mouthful, girl. Okay, so it says the length available is 16 to 24 inches. The density available is 130% and 150%. Hair color available in natural black. Bleach knots, or and they got camo, camo knots. I don't know if I'm saying it right, but I will have it somewhere over here so you guys can see it. Uh, hairline upgraded, realistic hairline, lace type, super fine, invisible Swiss lace, lace color, transparent lace, suitable for all skin tones. Okay, so those are all the details that they have on the site. Now, as for me, this is what I have. Okay, so it says the length is 18 inches, the density is 150%. The color, all the rest of it basically said the same thing, but I did want to let you guys know that I have 18 inches and it is 150% density. Keep in mind that it's also available in 130% if that's what you, that's like the vibe, that's the look that you're going for. Now, um, they did mention, uh, hold on, that it was wand curl and it was. I don't know if you guys really paid attention to the curls of this unit when I took it out of the packaging. It did have already come with some curls. I did add more, but it did definitely come with curls. And it says on here, upgraded realistic hairline. So I want you guys to look at this hairline and I definitely agree the hairline is pretty realistic. That is without me tweezing it whatsoever. Now you can tweeze it more if that's the more of the look that you that you go for. I personally think this wig looks, uh, the hairline looks nice on this wig without it being tweezed. But if that is something, you know, like that's your vibe. I know, you know, different floats, different strokes for different folks. But I personally think it looks good just like this. Uh, the hairline and I know you guys can see my cap. I had to put on a cap I actually have on three caps because now my little fro is turning into something else and I still can't braid it So I did have to put on the cap and I am not um, somebody that's gonna do the ball cap method She's just not gonna do it girl. Okay. <laughs> I have tried it, but it's a whole lot of whole lot of in my GD voice Okay, <laughs> in my GD Zoe voice. It's a whole lot of whole lot of so uh, I just I, I don't care Honestly y'all I just I just don't care but um, as you can see that the lace is definitely a transparent lace. I do feel like this lace is suitable for all skin tones. Uh, I do, I, I'm not really a fan of brown lace because to me it's not suitable for all skin tones. And uh, uh, it, it typically is a little too dark for me. So I do personally prefer the transparent lace over the, the brown lace. So that is uh, also a plus when it comes to this wig. Now, as far as shedding and tangling, like I've had this wig on for a good little bit now because I had to, I got started and then I put the wig on and then I had to go and do something. So I've now had this wig on for probably about four hours or so and I still have not received any shedding or any tangling with this unit whatsoever. So yeah, that shout out to you Diva Wigs for that. And um, as far as the cap construction, I think if I'm not mistaken child, the unit does come with two combs in the front, one comb in the back with adjustable straps. I do have the straps adjusted because child, <laughs> it still wasn't fitting my head like I needed it to. So I do want to say that in my opinion, this wig is big head friendly. I do want to see if you can get it in another size. Let me click on it right quick and see. Now, they have two cap sizes available. If I'm not mistaken, I do have average, but they do also offer petite. And if you get it in a different cap size, I don't think it changes. You know, it doesn't change the price whatsoever. I do also want to mention that if you do decide to um, get the 150% density, that it does um, increase the price. But as far as the cap size, it doesn't. Like the cap size, it'll still be the same price. So that is a plus as well when it comes to this wig. Now, I do want to also mention that this is a five by five lace closure okay so you can part this wig elsewhere if you want to i know recently because of the lace shortage that a lot of the wigs that i reviewing were reviewing you could not they were lace part closures but this one is a just complete lace closure wig so from here to here is your parting space okay so you can part it elsewhere if you want to and yeah that's basically it so i'm gonna go ahead and do a quick lint check even though this wig is 18 inches i do want to do a lint check so you guys can see what it looks like in the back so yeah let's do that okay so this is where the wig comes to me in the front 
Here it comes to me in the back. But yeah, I do feel like uh, that this, well, I don't know. I, mm, yeah, I do feel like this is 18 inches curled up. Like, I feel like it definitely seems a little longer than 18 inches if it was straightened out. So that's just my opinion. Like, let me know down below if you guys agree, if you think it, it seems to be uh, longer. It seems to be longer than 18 inches if you straighten the wig out. But in its, in its curled, one curl state, it does to me seem to be... Uh, 18 inches so yeah okay so if you are interested in how i feel about this unit as well as any products that i used um then please continue okay so honestly y'all i was not i don't know what i was thinking i don't know where my head was but i didn't even realize this was going to be a five by five closure wig and i was so happy when i took it out and i saw that it was like oh yes and i also love the the transparent lace I love the hairline. I love this wig. I feel like it looks really, really nice. It's a good natural everyday wig that you can kind of make it a little bit more sexy and wear it out. Like I feel like this wig, you can you can wear it every day if you want to. You can wear it to work if you want to, or you can jazz it up and you can wear it for a good date night, girls night out, whatever. I do feel like this wig is multi-purposeful. Child, that was a mouthful. <laughs> but I do feel like you can get a lot of different looks out of this one unit. So. I'm feeling it. To me, it's an entire vibe. Um, like I said, I feel like I can also wear this wig to work, like with it being in a natural color. And you can straighten it and get a more, you know, professional type of look. Or you can, like, like I said, jazz it up and you can get like a hot girl look. You know what I mean? So I am definitely feeling this wig. I love that it came with some curls and uh, I do feel like it came with the, some layers. I did layer it more, but I, I like the wig the way that it came because I feel like it makes the wig more beginner friendly. Especially if you're somebody that don't know how to tweeze a wig. Especially if you're somebody that don't know how to curl a wig. Like, I feel like because of how this wig is, you can, you can get some... It's, it's definitely more beginner friendly than not. So I'm feeling it. I think it is an entire vibe. Shout out to you Diva Wigs because your girl was not expecting this, okay? I am definitely happy with this wig. I do wish in the front that I had a used a razor to cut it so it don't look so, you know, straight across, you know, the razor. If you use like a razor from the beauty supply store, that gives you a more jagged look. But child, I feel like I be cutting off my whole lace when I'm doing that. I'm gonna have to find me some of those little zigzag scissors instead because honey, she just don't know how to cut. You know, I'm just not good at cutting, okay? So yeah, uh, as far as what I used and what I did to the wig, I did use, um, obviously, my bed head. I always use my bed head. I did, uh, that was to lay the wig. I did also use my wax stick and I used uh, some mousse. Uh, I just used this foam wrapping lotion mousse because child, that's the only one that I got like sitting here. I always use my wax stick and I do have a direct link to this down below in the description box if you want to use it. Keep in mind that it's an affiliate link, honey. So if you don't want me to get no coins, then don't use that link, girl. <laughs> and I did also use my Chi Helmet Head hairspray and I always like to use this to uh, hold my curls a little bit. Now, I want to say this, like, I feel like initially when I was curling my hair, child, I was not getting no curls. I thought it was the hair, okay? I was going to be so mad. <laughs> I was like, this hair does not hold the curl. But, child, my curling iron had turned off. So that, that's why she wasn't getting no curl, honey. Once I actually turned it on, I was definitely getting, I was definitely getting some curls. So, and they have basically held up pretty good. Like I said, I have been out and about. So, and they've held up pretty good. So, shout out to you once again. Like, I feel like this hair is just life, honey. Now, I will say it's not a very thick unit. It is 150% density, and I do feel like it is a true 150% density. Like, this is literally all of the hair right here, okay? So, if you like a super, super thick unit, this may not be the one for you. You may need to go up and find a unit that is 180% density. But in my opinion, like I love the density of this wig because it doesn't feel so heavy. And like I say, the density with this wig does make it more multi-purposeful, okay? So yeah, I'm feeling it. It's a vibe to me, girl, okay? So yeah, that's basically it. I did use my edge control um, to lay down the baby hairs and I always uh, use this even or even child. I never know how to say it. I'm gonna have to find somebody that says it right so I know what to say. But I do use this. 
uh, and I use that to lay my baby hairs. I definitely am a stan of baby hairs. I have said that for the longest and recently the, the bigger baby hairs have become a trend. So I've been trying to get with that. They're, they're a bit much and maybe it's cause I'm not doing them right. But uh, I was like, I wanna get on board. I'm gonna get with the, the, the new baby hair trend. Cause I feel like baby hairs, the trends change all the time. So that is basically it. So I'm gonna go ahead and give you guys a full 360 and we can wrap this thing all the way up. Okay, so this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. And this is it on the right side. Okay, so let me know down below what you guys think about this unit. Are you feeling it? Is it a vibe to you? Let me know down below in the comments because honey, it's a vibe to me, girl. Okay, so let me know what you guys think down below. And once again, shout out to you, Diva Wigs, for sponsoring this video and sending me this unit. I really do appreciate it. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions, something you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, click that subscribe button, sis. And if you're not ready to follow me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and Facebook. I'm Helton Misty on Snapchat and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you love us next time. Bye.